So last time I did a travel smash book, travel journal type thing, I did it all after I came back from my trip. Since my upcoming one is longer, I'm bringing some supplies and doing it on the road. Here's what I'm packing. So I have this Stadler pen case. I didn't really want it when it was purchased, but it came free with the pens that I did want. Buying it with the case actually worked out to be cheaper than without. So it's wonky, but here we are. And I've actually grown quite fond of it. So it zips up, and here when we open it, I have my Stadler pens. I've got my loose scotch tape roll, and then a ballpoint pen. This is one of the lesser expensive pens, but it writes really smoothly, and I find that my handwriting is really nice with it. I am very much a stationary girl, so here I have a package of page flags and post-its. I plan on using at least some of them as space holders for photos so that when they're printed out I know what to put and where. I have my white eraser and sharpener here because I do like pencil sketches. This plastic thing with packaging my Laurentian pencil crayons came in. I guess I kept it because I'm a pack rat, but look how organized and perfect everything fits. Picking which washi tape to take on my trip was like picking a favorite child, so I kind of didn't. I stuck a whole bunch on a plastic card so I can use them when I feel like. Here I've got my Sharpie and a gold and silver pen. On the back I've got some cutouts from scrapbook paper. This one actually looks like a gift tag. And I've got some more post-it notes here. And underneath this pile of stickers I've got some journaling cards. I made these clear vinyl stickers after finding the beautiful postmark images online by Kathy Holden from JustSomethingIMade.com. I'll see if I can find the link and put it below. I've got my scissors here and two pencils. I included a small notebook here for scribbles and ideas and planning pages. And then I have my watercolor pencil crayons. This means that I'm bringing a two-in-one with me because they act as pencil crayons, but if you add water, then it acts as watercolors. So it's really cool that they put it in this nice package and I can carry it with me. All of this zips up nicely in my Sadler pencil case. I'm bringing this poly envelope to protect my paper, which will be the meat of my scrapbook. I included two extra poly envelopes for anything that I might pick up along the way that I can stick in my book. On top, I have my small journaling cards, and because I'm planning on making two different books, one for China and one for Vietnam, I have two basic sizes for the pages. I combine different pads of paper, so I'm not sure that the color scheme goes together, uh, but I'm going to play around with it a little more before I go, and or just swap them out. Finally, I'm a binder clip junkie and it helps keep my papers together, so I'm bringing them along with me. I hope you enjoyed looking into my travel journal supplies kit. Let me know what you guys bring on your trips. See you soon!